Oh, you got another signal down this year, old. Oh, right. Hopefully, this is not another crusty rusty. Closer to this one, hopefully. Oh, it's a bit of dark soil. It is. It's a bit of dark soil just there. I think. I feel something hard right there. It's going to be a relic. Oh, I think it's a buckle. I think it's a buckle. Let's see if I can get you down the hole somehow, seeing as you're taped to the stand. There it is, look. You see it? It's a buckle. I don't know if you can see down there with the sun. Let's just ease it up. Oh, there it is. Ah, oh, that looks a bit different. That looks very different. That could be quite old. Yeah, that could be very old actually. Oh, just as a helicopter flies over. Right. Ah, see that? I don't think it's very old. It's got an iron pin. They didn't tend to have iron pins, I don't think. But they might have done. It's got an old look about it. Right. I'll get that cleaned up and get back to you. I don't recognise the design. We've got, we're having a day of first, said the day. The day of first, that strange buckle with the pivot on it, and now this. Oh, there we go, look. It's got file marks on it, so it's quite old. It just reminded me slightly of an Anglo-Saxon type design. It's got, like, bumps on this side. So it must have been cast on, onto, like, a bed of sand or something. Because this side's quite rough. What do you think? Anglo-Saxon? A thousand year old buckle? On to the next! Oh, this was a bit iffy on the surface. It's even more iffy now. What's that there? It looks like pottery. Is it pottery or is it a rock? It's a rock. <laughs> ah. Oh, bit of dark soil just there. Not another relic. Oh, I've missed that big coil. That big coil finds a lot of good things. Oh, what's that there? Looks like a pesky button. Uh, 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 a silver washed pesky button. Yeah, silver wash. Domed. Got a nice dome on it, a sort of like a, an Elizabethan style. Oh, look at the shine on that. Right, there's something. Did I see writing on the back or not? Uh, no, I don't think so. Uh, oh, the words is corroded off. Yes, yeah, so it's quite a nice shine to the pesky button. Nothing on there. On to the next. Oh, I had this huge iron signal right here, and I thought, oh, let's, let's see what it is. Because you never know, it might be an Anglo-Saxon spearhead. And uh, I think it could be. Oh, 
Look. It's got a wedge shape. Right. Does it go under? It does. Right, so it's either... Well, what is it either? A ploughshare point or an axe. I'd like an axe. I do like axe heads. My favourite iron object. Oh, no, it's not an axe head. It might be a, it might be a splitting wedge. Yeah, it's a splitting wedge. A splitting wedge for splitting logs. And there's the groove going down the side, look. Well, I'll keep that. They come in handy. I got a wood burning stove. <laughs> and that'll come in handy for splitting logs. Lovely jubbly. Oh, it's a bit iffy. Or it could be cack, but it could also be something really nice. <laughs> Ooh, oh, that's a rock. Oh, that wasn't a rock. I hope it was a rock. Oh. Right. Still down there, me thinks. Excuse me, bit of worm. Right. What's up there? No, nope, nothing. I'm had a bit of lead today. Oh, famous last words. moved it. What have I moved? I can't see anything. What's that there? That's a rock. Hmm? Did, it, did they even have the right target in the first place? See anything? It's got to be still down there, surely. Oh, what's that there? That looks like a nail. Huh. Oh, it's still down there, somewhere. Oh, it's a button. It's a... Is it a button? Yeah, I think it's a button. It's got a funny thing on the back. Right, let's get that cleaned up and get back to you. Ah, oh, it's got some letters on the back. You see that there? It looks like IB, maybe. I think it's IB. And on this side it's just nothing. So maybe a maker of buttons. Looks like IB. Looks like an I, two dots, a B and a dash. 